Hi friends. Sorry to keep you waiting. Five minutes. I'm so sorry. I lost track of time trying to get those last few last minute lots together. Thanks everyone for coming in. You guys are awesome. Okay, let's see. Emville, hello. Hello, new profile picture. Hello, toilet girl. <laughs> hello. Hi, James. Hope you are well. The party moving over here now. Yeah, thanks. You guys, I was over at Robin's premiere for a few minutes while I was doing that last minute rush around. Hello, Michigan lady, Mary Brown. Hello, welcome. Welcome, welcome. And Julie, hello. Thanks for being here. Detective Steve, hello. James Sisko, my friend, hello. Thank you for being here. Just me. You guys are awesome. Thanks. We'll just give everybody hello, Betty Webb. Nice to meet you. Hello, hello. We'll just give everybody a minute to stroll in. You guys are awesome. Hi, Linda. Thank you for being here. Hey, Fancy. There's Rachel. Rachel's going to be on with T tonight, you guys. T goes on at, um, I should know this, seven? Rachel, put it in the chat. Seven, eight? I don't know. I'm not, um, I'm not sure. Cherie, um, I have an order for you, but I don't have your information. If you could please um, uh, send me an email, that would be great. We'll see who's in the chat, who can help moderate. Any, um, any volunteers? Becky G, hello. Welcome, welcome. Thanks for being here. Lisa, hi, honey. And Bind Space, hello, Shelly. And let's see, my friend Christopher, thank you. And Dolores, thank you for coming. Invisible Bitters in the house, thank you for being here. And Joe is here, flipping flamingos. Hello, Joe. Dakota, hello. Connie, thanks, you guys. Thank you so much. Sun, moon, cricket, hello. Dolores is saying me. Is that to my response to my, um, is today invisible birth, is today invisible bitter's birthday? Is that what's going on here? I don't know. Don't know. Froggy. Hey, Deals. Beautiful Joy Munkin. Hello, honey. Hi, Susie. It's thundering and lightning in South Florida like crazy today. All day it's been thundering and lightning. Sun, moon, cricket. Hey, love. Hi, Tony. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Thanks for being here. It's at seven. Okay. Over to T's at seven. It's four, five, six, seven. Yeah. In three hours, he's going to have an auction with, um, with Rachel. Hi, Texas Val. Hello, sweetheart. Um, let's see here. I'm going to start reselling again on eBay. Should I use my older profile or start a new one? Oh, you definitely want to use your older one if you've got good reviews on it. Um, hi, Camille. Hi, honey. Thanks for coming in. Um, if you've got if you've got positive feedback, you definitely want to keep going with the old one that you had. Um, if you don't have positive feedback, you may want to consider starting um, a new one. Um, I I don't know if maybe T has it. Um, she said that she sent it to me, but last I looked. Um, yeah, I still have your ring right here. Um, last I looked, I didn't see it. So that would be great if you could send it again. Um, hey, love Hollis. 
so we'll just give everyone a few minutes to stroll in. <clears throat> Can I be a mod? Um, Becky, you need to register to get a blue wrench and I'm going to wait for someone to come in. Just finished my first year on eBay and I have 820 positive feedback. Yeah. You know, the best way to get positive feedback, you guys, is to actually, yes, Wes, it's an auction. Hey, T, thanks. There's T. Um, the best way to get positive feedback is to, um, just buy inexpensive little things um, from companies because they like will automatically give you positive feedback and that will bring your positive feedback up or list small items that you know you can handle and, and like ship out right away and, and you can get positive feedback. Um, Annie, hello. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you for being here. Um, Oh, is that how you get feedback? I just pay for it. Yeah, no, it's for new accounts. That's the best way is if you're, if you guys um, are looking for positive feedback, just buy from companies that sell small things, household things that you might need and stuff. And you'll be able to get your positive feedback up there um, or your, you know, your feedback, which is really important. I mean, I never really look at feedback when I'm buying on, on, um, on eBay, if I like something, I buy it. I mean, I sometimes, like once in a while, I will look at feedback. But um, hi, Lucinda. Welcome in, honey. Thanks for being here. Appreciate. Hello, Leon. Leon's in the house. And I see Invisible Bitter saying hi to Tammy. Is it Invisible Bitter's birthday? Did someone answer me? Hi, Tammy. There you are. I don't want to skip over anybody. If I have skipped over anybody, no hard feelings. I just, the chat moves really fast and I'm scrolling through now to see if there's anybody I didn't say hello to. Um, but yeah. Ronnie G. Hello, Ronnie G. Hi, all. Please accept my apology for not saying hi to you individually. I'm listening, working in the background. Yeah, T is listing, listing, listing. She's like a listing fool today. Uh, storage scavenger. Mouth closed. Don't know what that means. Leon saying hello to everyone in the chat. Yep, and for those of you that are coming in late, T and Rachel will be going on at 7 this evening for an auction on T's channel. Um, and I am looking for a moderator. If anybody can moderate, please. Um, hey, Gerald's Gaming Nation. Thanks for being here. Thanks for joining. Um, T, if you could drop that link. I don't have it. I don't have it saved. If you could drop it in case there's anybody that's, uh, that's new that wants to register um, for the auction. We do ask for registrations. We do send invoices. We don't um, ask for immediate payment. Um, T and I both and our um, T's guest, I was gonna say our guest, but they're really her guest on her channel. Um, we ask that everybody use invoicing. Um, I just think it's, keeps track of things a little bit neater and better. Everybody does it the way they want, but. Oh, and James will be on T's. Oops, it skipped tomorrow night. Storage scavenger, you guys will be on T's tomorrow night. Hey, Jojo. Oh, it is Invisible Bitter's birthday. Happy birthday, Invisible Bitter. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. There it is. Okay, if someone could could grab that for me and help moderate, that would be great if anybody's in the mood um, for moderating, that would be awesome. I could use the help. Hi, 
Hi, Carla. Hey, welcome in. Thank you. No bear. Yep, I'm going to do the bear. I'm going to sing happy birthday to Invisible Bitter. Okay. All right, you guys, here we go. Here we go. We don't want to leave anybody out, even though it's an Invisible Bitter. Happy birthday. I hope all your birthday wishes come true. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Invisible Bitter. Happy birthday to you. Hooray! Make a wish and blow out the candle. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Invisible Bitter. Happy birthday. All right. Mike Newsom is in the house, not to be confused with Mike Newhouse. <laughs> hmm. Because she shed is in the house. Hey, Robin, I watched your, um, your premiere just a little while ago. I didn't get to see the whole thing because I was putting lots together and getting ready, but I'll go back and watch it after I finish my show. Um, hi, Rise Up. Thanks for being here. You guys are great. All right. Nice group of you are in. I appreciate it. Um, okay. Uh, thanks, Annie. Okay, so you guys, now would be a good time, Annie or... Um, Detector Steve, I don't know why you don't have a wrench. I thought you were registered, but maybe you're not. Um, Gerald's Gaming Nation, if anybody wants to register to bid, now would be a good time to do it. And T dropped the link. Let me see. Let me go grab it. Here it is. Let me put that back. Let me just grab that copy and put it in the chat. T, I don't know if I get notification of um, of that or if it just goes to you. I'm not, I'm not sure. Let me go get my phone. Be right back, you guys. Okay, I've got my phone. Um, but like I said, I don't know if I get notification or if that just goes right to T, but I can always get the registration information. Is that a jar of cookies? That is a jar of polish. Um, I have it up and I will let you know if you get one. Yes. Yeah, so that registration only goes to T. So um, I'm going to put my, um, also, um, because I don't get notification on that. So auction, let's see. Yeah, it's nail polish. What time is the giveaway? Also, is your teenager single? Donatello, please answer. Is your teenager single? Donatello, please answer. So I'm going to do a couple of giveaways. And as far as my teenagers being single, I don't know if I want to answer that. <laughs> Thank you, Carla. Thank you for dropping that. I appreciate it. Donna said corks, not cookies. I don't know what that means. 
don't know what that means. Okay, so let me go um, register for Donna here, but that is T's. Yeah, just register on T's, and then T will just forward it to me because I don't have that. Um, I don't have that. We don't have that set up, so it comes directly to me. To our Steve grandsons. Troll time out by Mama G the other day, Donna. Oh, really? Which one? Annie just registered. Thank you, Annie. I'll wait for T to give me the, um, that you registered. Hey, Mr. Turtle Trader. Hello. Welcome. All right, we're going to get started momentarily. Just let everyone say hello to each other and... Give everyone a minute to come in. Okay. So um, I am going to have Dolores asking inappropriate questions. Okay. Thank you, Tammy. We'll keep an eye on that. It was super fun shopping with you and the guys yesterday. Thanks. Yeah, it was fun. They wanted to go again today. They wanted to go to a, they wanted to go to another um, thrift shop, but I just, I had too much to do today. So I told them that we couldn't, but, um, Annie and Becky both registered. Thank you, ladies. All right. Um, Becky, 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 Becky. Let's see. Becky, can you make a comment? Um, so I don't have to scroll up and find you, and I'll give you a wrench, and that will let you. Go ahead and register. Ooh, did you hear that, you guys? It's crazy. Um, yes, Donna's doilies, Matt. Hi, Matt. Yes. <laughs> so let's see. Lucinda, you timed out Dolores. Why did, did Dolores say something inappropriate? I didn't see. Mm, let's see. What time is the giveaway? All right. Yeah. All right. Nice and loud. Yeah, that was crazy, right? Hello, Marielle. Hello, Empty Wallet. Always great stuff in these auctions. Thank you, Detector Steve. Thank you for being here. Appreciate it. Okay, everybody, make sure that you are on live chat and not top chat. Hey, Jules. Oh, no, with Rosa? Are you on the way to the hospital? Oh, goodness. I, I hope everything's okay. She asked about the giveaway. It's okay to ask about the giveaway. It's fine to ask about the giveaway. Don't have to time somebody out because of that. It's crazy here, Donna. Tornado and Adventura and our weather is bad. Rachel, it has been, when I tell you, pouring, 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 pouring. Yeah, Mike, it's true, right? Um, that's why I didn't answer it. Um, it's been pouring here all day since early, early. It's been pouring. It's been crazy. It's been crazy, crazy. Okay. So I brought for you a, I brought a dibble. I bought a dibble lot. I, I bought, Oh, I have to take this. This is, um, this is someone who's got some great stuff for me. I'm going to put myself on mute one second and take it. You guys just talk amongst each other for one So you guys, this is like an incredible, incredible opportunity for me. This is, um, it's actually a nonprofit that I donate a lot of stuff to. And they got 
um, when the local um, Kmart store closed down, they got a huge donation from their toy store, and they literally have a tractor trailer full of brand new toys, and they want to offer it to me. I can't buy the tractor trailer, but a lot of it they want to offer to me, and of course, I will, I'll make a very generous contribution to the nonprofit, you know, mon a monetary con contribution. So that's my latest like gig that I'm, that I'm working on all new toys, like new in the package toys. So I am so excited about it. Um, let's see. Hello, Ed. Ed, I loved your message. I, I responded to it. I, you, you, Ed writes me these like stories and it's, I love it. I love it, Ed. Thank you. <laughs> I love your stories that you send me. Hi, Jill. Hi, honey. Thanks for coming in. You guys, thanks for strolling in. Okay. So this is what I have. And you guys don't forget the thumbs up, please, on the video. Um, I really appreciate it. It helps. Um, so I have a dibble box, I have clothes, I have polish, I have jewelry, I have some, some pretty amazing stuff. So, um, and then I'm going to grab some one-offs too that I, I might do. We'll see how much we can get done. Um, and I'm going to start and I'm going to start with this. I'm going to start with this. This is, I think, 50, this is a shelf pull, shelf pull polish and, um, from what I understand, polish is selling well. Um, and yeah, so, you know, polish isn't sealed. So you're going to have to check the regulations and stuff. But this is a, I think, 50, 50 bottles of polish. Okay, let me go over to YouTube. And I'm going to start this off. It's got to go ground and it's really expensive. So I am going to start it off to ship ground. So I am going to start it off at $35. $35 um, shipping is free. $35 for the big, huge jar of all different nail polishes. And for those of you that are new, I buy shelf pulls um, from stores. If anybody is interested in this big, huge jar of all polishes. All different brands, Tammy. They're not one specific. Like that one, I think is probably o OPI or something. Um, they're they're all different brands. Um, Thirty five to Shelley. So, like for example, I can just show you some Broadway colors. Quick dry. Um, no idea what this one is. This one is. Arden, Ardenair. Hey, Jonathan Roseberry. Thank you so much, sweetheart, for the, for the, this one, Sally Hansen. They're just all different ones. This one is, look at, I didn't even know Marvel made polishes. That one's Marvel. Um, what does that one say? Donna, Michelle. So yeah, just all different all different polishes, all different colors, all different brands. We've got Shelly at 40. Thank you, Shelly. Every color of the rainbow, there's metallics in there. It's all different ones. Purples and reds and blue, gold. 42 to Tony. Thank you, Tony. Shelly's out. Green and silver. There's top coats. All right, 42 is the high bid. Does anybody want to come in at 44? Or we're going to close at, there's a kind of like a, I don't know, metallic-y one. If you do airbrushing, these are great for model painting artwork. Oh, hey, Carol. Carol Ann, thanks for being here. Um, Dolores, you're not registered, so that bid is still at $42. I don't know, T, did Dolores register? So 
So $42 is where we're at right now. You must be registered to bid. We're going to call it to Tony. We're going to go once for 42. Tammy comes in at 45. Hi, sweetheart. Hi, Carol. Um, no, she's not registered. Okay. So Dolores, unless you register, we're going to time you out again. Look at how pretty that kind of orangey sparkle one is. Um, no, T's working. She's listening, Jill. She's listening in the background. Yep, she's listening in the background. She's coming on at seven with Rachel. Donna, I bought a sunglass lot from you. Just sold one pair for $400. Wow. Are you kidding, Jojo? Oh, my gosh. Okay, listen. So I want to do, a, Courtney did something. Courtney, are you listening in the background, Bolo Buddies? I want to do a video of um, things like that. Um, things that people sold. I want to, I want to compile a whole bunch of like listings and promote your uh, eBay channels and, you know, the picture and what it sold for. If you, if you could send me emails of Donna has not been bolo busted today yet, James, if you could send me emails of your sold items, um, and if you remember what you paid for, for the lot, I want to try to do a video of like compile all of that together. Cause I think it would really help my channel that people see. Do you remember the other day somebody came in and was like, these are not wholesale prices. These prices are too high. And then a bunch of people came on and were like, uh, I bought this and sold it for this. And I bought that. So yeah, that would be awesome. Thank you so much. Con con congratulations on your sale. Um, uh, let's see. Marvel nail polish gives a lady superhuman abilities. <laughs> Hi, Leon. Okay. We're going to close it for $45, $45 to Tammy. Is there any other takers? We're going to go once. Oh, thanks toilet girl. You say that every time I wear this top. Thank you, honey. You like my white one too. You always compliment me on the white one. You're so sweet. All right. $45 going twice. $45 going three times with a fair warning. We are sold, 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 sold for the polish to Tammy for $45. Thank you, sweetheart. Thank you so much for starting off the auction. I appreciate it. Donna, tell that person to bite your buns. <laughs> what person? <laughs> Thank you, Tammy. Mwah. Goodbye on all that. Right, Mike? Exactly. I mean, you, nail polish is so, so expensive. Okay. So um, I'm going to do this lot next. This is like 20, I think it's 26 pounds of books. Um, it's all Wizard of Oz books. They're really beautiful. Um, I'll show you what I have. I'm going to start just because of shipping. I'm going to ship it media. Um, but even though it's media, it's still going to be expensive because it's 26 pounds. So I'm, I'm going to start this off at $35 also. Okay. Um, so the first one is this one. It's called The Wizard of Oz, an illustration companion to the timeless movie classic. That's number one. So this person was a Wizard of Oz collector. The 100th anniversary celebration. Um, this one is sealed. The original price on it was $24.99. There's a lot of people that collect Wizard of Oz stuff. So this one's sealed in plastic. It's not open. And this one, the Wizard of Oz. This looks like it might be an older one. It does not have a barcode on it. So this might be an older Wizard of Oz book. Anybody who likes to list books, this is a nice collection. Here's the Wizard of Oz again. So that's one, two, three, four. This one is five. 
It's a collector's guide to the Wizard of Oz. This one is definitely old. This one is six and it has that price tag on it. That one is six. Here's another nice old one. This one is seven. These are all really beautiful books and they are in excellent condition. This one is eight. Um, thank you, Robin, for timing out. I don't know what happened. Hi, Courtney. I was just talking about you, honey. This one is not Wizard of Oz. What is this? Beyond the Secret Garden. I don't know, but you get that one. This one, so that was eight, that's nine. This one's 10, and you can see they're in excellent condition. Here's another one that's closed. It's not open. It's still sealed. This is the 55th anniversary edition. Another beautiful sealed one. Is there any interest? We have Christopher in at 30. Um, I wanted to start it at 35, if possible, just because I think it's going to be expensive. Here's one, the 55th anniversary edition, but this one's open. What is it? Like it's, oh, it's like the transcript of The Wizard of Oz. Pretty cool. And, and here we have The Wonderful Wizard of Oz. And I lost count, but I'll, I'll look at them in a minute. And here we have Dorothy Return to Oz. And the last one in the collection is this one, is The Wizard of Oz. And the illustrations. Oh, thanks, guys. Look at how beautiful these books are. Oh, look at that. Look at the illustrations on them. Really great. This is a beautiful collection. Okay, so let me count them and, let you, and I'll tell you how many I have. So I have one, two, three. Thanks, Carrie. Isn't it great? Three, this is four and five and six and seven. eight and nine and 10. And you can see you guys, no dust. These were kept in excellent condition. Here's 11. And this one has some bookmarks in it. They must have like been looking stuff up. 11 and 12. I love this one is 13. And here's another one that's not opened is 14. And this one is 15. This one is 15. It's really awesome. Okay. We have Tammy in at, thank you, Carol, Carla, for helping. Tammy at 175, holding at 175. Thank you, Robin. Jonathan's like, wow, yeah, they're beautiful. And there's a lot of Wizard of Oz, like people that collect Wizard of Oz. People love Wizard of Oz. Going once to Tammy. Thanks, Robin. And we're going to go twice to Tammy. And three times to Tammy, and we are sold, 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 sold to Tammy for 175. Thank you, Tammy. Thank you so much, my dear. Thank you. Thank you. Turtle Traders says, 
nice lot. It is a nice lot. It's a beautiful lot. Thank you so much for bidding. Okay. I am going to move this. I have assistants, but they're in their rooms. Bless their hearts. Did you let Boston out, Chessie? Yeah. He sits right in my way, and I can't move, honey. He's scared because of the lightning. I know he is. Here, bring this. Take this, please. This big lot. I know he's scared. Can't pull, carry it from the bottom. It's really heavy. Okay. So Chesie put these together. These are uncurated. Whoops. Are you all right, Ches? Yeah. Okay. Um. Look at what a nice job she did. Okay, now this comes with the earring holder. Um, how come it looks like there's one missing? All right, we'll have to find it. There's one missing here. It must have fallen down. So there's one missing. But it comes, it comes with the stand. It comes with um, she is toilet girl. She's a sweetheart. She's my baby. Um it comes with the stand, and a lot of them are, are vintage and signed, and I'm going to start this at 25, and I'm going to find that one that's missing. Don't worry. Uncurated. She put this together, so she doesn't know to look for gold or silver because she's young, <laughs> so um, she put this together for me earlier. 25 is the start. I just had her match them up and put them on. Oh my gosh, Lucinda, you're kidding. Goodness, tell her no. <laughs> tell her no. Okay, we have Amy in at 27. This is a beautiful stand, you guys. It's it's um I don't know if you can see it, but it's velvet. It's gray velvet. It's beautiful. It's so pretty. Jill is in at 30. Thank you, Jill. I know, Tammy. So do I. I do not like snakes at all. Um, I'm gonna give you a close-up because I know you guys like to see the close-up on them, how pretty they are. I like to see the close-up, too. Those definitely look like cloisonne. Those are vintage. I don't know what kind of stones those are. Those are So there's a combination of clip-ons and um, here you can see. She did both clip-ons. You can see which ones are the clip-ons and which ones. Not all of them have backs, you guys, but you can buy backs pretty inexpensively. Tammy is at 40. Tammy's at 40. Amy is out. Thank you, Robin. All right, we're going to call it to Tammy. Anybody else want to come in? Tammy's going to win it for $40. All right, we're going to go once. Hi, Nance P. We're going to go twice. Those are really pretty right there. And with a fair warning, forty-two to Jill. Thank you, Jill. Is I don't know if there's a lag. Forty-two dollars to Jill. Fifty to Tammy. She jumps right up. She loves it. Jill, let us know you're out, honey. If you are out. 
I like those door knocker ones. Those are so timeless. It's a nice lot. About a 15 second lag. Thank you, Dakota. Jill is out. Tammy gets it for 50. Can you take this, honey? Angelina. Can you put this on um on that counter right there very carefully so they don't fall off? Thank you, sweetheart. 50 to Tammy. Congratulations, Tammy. Airing lot. Thank you so much. Okay. This thanks, Tammy. Um, how do you like my new mug? I bought that for myself. You like it? You go, girl. I have to remind myself of that every morning when I wake up. Yeah. You go, girl. I do. I have to remind myself. Hi, Heidi. Okay. So, and you know what's good about drinking out of a mug like this? Like, you guys don't know if this is coffee water, beer, wine, or fireball. Where's Farmer? Where is Farmer? Hey, Johnny, Cajun Root Resellers in the house, you guys. Where is Farmer? Nobody knows what I'm drinking. What do you guys think I'm drinking? You think it's a fireball, Carla? Really? <laughs> Really? <laughs> oh, farmer. Where is that man? Okay. This is my next lot. So what I love about lots like this is it gives you an opportunity to try products that you maybe otherwise wouldn't buy. Um, and this is some of this is shelf poles and some of it came out of storage units, but I'm going to show you what's in this lot. I'm going to start it at $25. This can ship round because it doesn't have any alcohol in it. Um, but, <clears throat> okay, the first item, and this could be for resellers or it can be for personal use or even for gift giving. But it comes with this, the box is a little bit crushed. You can see, like, that's why they get, they get pulled off the shelves because nobody will buy this in the store, even though it just has that little bit of a crushed mark. But it's brand new, and it is bamboo charcoal body scrub detox. I'm surprised my, my daughters didn't see that. Um, aches and pains at nighttime relief, mineral bath soak. So there's just a nice assortment of, there's one of these um, brushes. And then there's, hi, Amy Jo. There's one and two and three of these like scrubby things in there. There's a Tinkerbell bubble bath in there. And then there's aloe, which looks like uh, some of it's been used, but it looks like it's in, still in great condition. Um, this is iced peppermint daily body lotion. Um, this one is Claro Color Crave Hair Makeup Brilliant Ruby, I guess, for red hair. And this one is inspired by Beyonce by Red Lace. Is that one? This one is Sunflower Cashmere Bath and Body Works. Starting bid on this is $25. This is facial spray with aloe herbs and rose water. Mario Babus Babuski something. I don't know. I can't pronounce that. Whatever that is. Um, this one is Royal Roy, Roy, uh, Rose, Royal Roy Rose. Um, I can't read the label, but you get that. Looks like a body wash type of thing. And then you get this cute little gift set. Um, this is some sort of, it's got a little, little soap and scrub brush thing cute for a little gift or for personal use. I don't know. Amber brush shea vitamin E body lotion. Um, 
Mary Kay time wise micro durabrasion something and then you get these one two and three these are all new shelf pulls they're moose um those are moose and then you get this moisturizing shampoo by suave and one of these petty things are in there and this probably came from a hotel or something i don't know it looks like chinese but it says bath towel disposable bath towels which is great and then some curlers <coughs> and that's the whole lot is there any beds anybody interested in all of these um different bath products shampoos lotions mousses body scrubs and if there's no bids, great stocking stuffers. Yes, absolutely. It's a lot of product here. Yep, think outside the box. Even if you're not a reseller, this is shipped. It would make a nice basket for someone, nice gift. And it looks like there's no interest. Go to go stuff to get ready for tonight. See you all later. Okay, honey. We'll see you later on. And Carlos is to pass on it. Okay, we'll pass on it. No problem. Jill says to pass on it too. All right, Jill. We will pass. Oh, Tony says 25. All right, Tony. $25 for everything. $25 bid. If there's no other interest, we'll send it to Tony for $25. She's getting a heck of a deal. If you were to buy all this stuff, it would be way more than that. We're going to call it once to Tony. Thank you, Tony. It's fun to use products that you're not used to, like, buying on a regular basis. I know I always go after the same stuff. We're going to go twice to Tony. And with a fair warning, she got it. Robin got it. Sold to Tony. Lot number four. Winner is Tony for $25. And I'm going to call this bath products. All right, let me just go put this away. Congratulations, honey. Let me get it out of the way. I'll be right back. Which one, Boston? Which one, honey? Keep going. Okay, I'm going to do a dibble box. I'm going to do a dibble box. It's going to be, um, I guess, for resellers or personal use. Let's see what I put in here. Okay, so the first thing that's here is a brand new monopoly set it's 2000 it's sealed it's never been opened let's start this dibble box at 25 dollars okay it's a monopoly millennium monopoly the next item is a brand new unopened puzzle 3d puzzle next are piano books you get one, two, three, four, five piano books. Next is, I have no idea what this is. This is called Simplex Toys Made in Holland. Hi, Jennifer Hayes. Thanks for coming in, honey. 
and it is i don't know what it is you guys are going to have to look it up but it's made in holland and it's got all of these kind of like wooden like pieces i don't know if it's a matching game or what it is but you get that simplex toys made in holland um you get a lily pulitzer men's tie it's a game like dominoes oh cool okay and you got a brooks brothers men's tie hey gary thanks for coming in okay so you get two designer ties then you got um so these are they sit flat so they're maybe onyx maybe marble um paperweights i would say and you get one there's some sort of stone marble stone i have no idea what they are two this one looks like marble no people alabaster probably heidi three and maybe jade and four in that little box okay and then you get this bag full of ephemera it's just i just grabbed the pig is adorable i just grabbed from a box that i had and it's just i didn't go through it i don't know what's in here um there's some there's some letters Let's see what that's postmarked 20 cents i don't know what it's postmarked but anyways, this is, and it's got a bunch of old photos in here. Some of these, some of this stuff came from the World War II storage unit. Um, and some of it was just miscellaneous stuff that I had. Um, so I don't know. I don't know what it is, but it's just, it's just, a, it's just a bag full of um, senior, senior hop. 1941 just to give you an idea senior hop looks like just a little like a little tiny look at it it's got a little pen attached to it look how cute that is it's very cute okay so that comes in the dibble box and this fatigues shirt comes in the dibble box along with this um i don't know if this is a work belt an army belt or what it is but this comes in it you guys will have to figure it out what else did i put in here this for boxing and that's everything okay so you get that these two army pieces you get the two designer ties lily pulitzer and brooks brothers yeah that's headgear for boxing you get this maiden holland domino set according to robin it's like dominoes you get these piano books You get this 3D puzzle, brand new, unopened. You get this Monopoly Mon Millennium 2000 unopened.
you get the bag of ephemera pictures and brochures and postcards and all kinds of stuff in there and then you get all these alabaster eggs in this box with the possible i'm not sure um jade pig maybe or alabaster don't know hi lisa's treasures comes in at 50 thanks you guys i'll show you the eggs again the eggs are beautiful cold looks like jade i know right carla it does hey connie thanks for bidding i didn't know you were bidding i didn't see you thank you so much We have Lisa at 50. Hey, Sunny B Thrips, thanks for coming in. 95 of you here this afternoon. Thank you. This early evening. Um, yep, so Carla is out. So that's a nice dibble box. Anybody else? We've got Lisa at 50. Should we call it to Lisa? We're going to go once to Lisa. And we're going to go twice to Lisa. I'm going to just move the box a minute while you guys decide. Move, boss. Move. Okay, and with a fair warning, Mama G. Hey, Mama G's in the house. Thanks, honey. Lifetime, hello. Thank you for coming. It's a dibble box. It's $50. We're going to go three times. Little this, little dibble, a dibble bit of this, and a dibble bit of that. It's assortment of random things. Yeah, a couple of games and statues and. Just a bunch of stuff, a whole bunch of stuff. And okay, with a fair warning. We are sold. Sold, sold, sold to Lisa's treasures. What a deal, Lisa, for $50 for the Dibble Box. Okay. I'm going to do my first giveaway, my first giveaway. So what I'm going to give away is a dog lot, a plush lot for your dog. So I'll show it to you. Now, excuse me, boss. So now people have told me that I sell these for $25. And people have told me that they have found valuable, postable things in these dog lots. So I am going to ship this out as a free gift. I'm going to ask uh, Robin if you could put some hearts in the chat. That's how Mama G usually does it. Um, Robin, if you could put some hearts in the chat. And... Um, what if you don't have a dog? Give it to your neighbor, love, <laughs> um, or to your friend. Um, after Robin puts hearts in the chat, the first, hi, Kathy, Music55 is in the house. First person to write, I love my dog, gets the dog lot. Okay, I have Shelly as, oh, I love my fog. <laughs> it needs to be dog. Susie Woozy. I think Susie Woozy is the first one to write, I love my dog. 
If somebody could confirm that for me, I think it was Susie Woozy that gets the free dog lot. Was it Heidi? Let's see. I see Robin's hearts. Um, Heidi, I have three dogs, but loves them. Who trashes their toys, but loves them. I have three dogs, Brutus and Boxer Roddy, who trashes their toys, but loves them. I said to put, I love my dog. Um, I think Shelly's the first one, you guys. It's, is it Shelly? Let me see. Nope, Fog. Susie Woozy. Is it Susie Woozy? I love my dog. Yep, Susie, right? Just help me confirm. Okay, yep, it's Susie. All right, dog lot. Susie. Winner. Free. Okay. So with that being said, if there's anybody who would love to buy their dog, a dog lot shipped, $25. This is what you get. $25 shipped. You can just let me know in the chat. You can write just the word dog if you want me to send one of these to you for $25 shipped. And I'll be happy to send it. If anybody would like to buy a dog lot for $25. Let's see. Amy would like one. Amy Dorito. It's all plush. Yes. Yep, it's all plush for $25. Um, yes. I see that from Amy. <laughs> I love my frogs. Is the F next to the, the D? <laughs> hmm. Who was it? Shelly that wrote, I love my frog instead of I love my dog. Is that who it was? Let me see. Let me go up. Let me go up and see. Um, looking for Robin. Robin, was it? I love my clogs. <laughs> Susie Woozy, let's see. Okay. Um, Where is it? Yeah, it was Shelly. Shelly, I'm going to send you one too. Shelly Tarbet. You're going to get one too. <laughs> Free dog lot. And then, you know who else I'm going to send one to? To Heidi. I'm going to send one to Heidi Leslie. Because she took the time to write. <laughs> the not long story but she didn't write I love my dog and so that's three free giveaways on the dog lots you guys three of them all right I was wrong my dog is huge he would choke on them yeah you're gonna have to watch them I do I do I do, um, um, Shelly, I will send you a dog lot for a big dog. Because I have big, big ones. Oh, thanks, Steels. Yep. I'll send you, I'll, Shelly, I put down for a big dog. So I'll send you big stuffed animals. All right. Anybody else want to buy a dog lot? Mine hasn't destroyed the others yet, Donna. Okay, good. Let me know when you're ready. How about a frog lot? <laughs> oh, that's going to be tough. One of my dogs is so sick with love a new toy. 
the cat lot. Oh yes, Denise, you wanted little ones, little, little ones for, for cats. All right, I'm gonna write that down, Denise. I forgot about that. I know that you said you wanted um, small for cats toys. All right, I'll see if the girls can hunt those down. Did I say clogs? Yeah, I will. I'll look for little, little ones for sure. Okay. Okay, you guys. So that was three. All right. We'll do another one in a few minutes. Um, so we are on lot number 11. Lot number 11. Happy meal trolls. Right? Okay. All right, so let's see. Let me put this dog lot away. Excuse me, Boston. Excuse me, baby. Excuse me. You need to go lie down out in the living room. You'll be fine. Trust me. You're okay. Okay, let's do a plush lot. So this is all sellable stuff. Okay, all sellable plush lot stuff. So the first one in here is Minnie Mouse and it is marked Disney, $25 to start. So you've got Minnie, you've got <laughs> Tickle Me Elmo. Okay, you've got um, Curious George, his little bag, it says Morning Star, but it's got a little bit of dirt on the back of it. See it up there? Just a little bit, but um, um, Curious George. And this one is Boys and Girls Club of America 2015. Don't know if there's a calling for that. There could be, I'm not sure. This one is Manhattan Toy Company and it is a puppet. I know puppets have a great following and this one looks like it's like a, a lizard. Oh, look at it and you can even, oh God. Yeah. So this is a Manhattan Toy Company puppet. And next we have Aeropostale. Aeropostale, and next, Eden. There's a nice following for Eden toys. They're really um, nicely made. Um, again, this is like the type of toy that I look at and said someone got this when their baby was born and they lost it in some hotel or something. And there's a parent out there looking for this for sure. Um, this one says home sweet home. I don't know what it is. It's a cute little puppy. I'm thinking it's maybe, I don't really know what this does. Um, this is the name of the company. Happy Nappers. Oh, so it's a napping thing. So maybe it's a toy. It looks like it has a zipper. I don't know if everything is supposed to like go inside of here and turn into a pillow maybe? I have no idea. You guys will have to figure it out. I don't know what that is. <clears throat> and here we have one of the Disney princesses on there. And then I still have some of these, so I put a bunch of these in here. These are the tissue box holders and these are the puppy ones. So I have one, two, Brand new, three, four, five, six, and seven. There's seven of them. Seven tissue box holders. Okay. 
Okay. So seven of those, seven, eight, nine, 10. The puppet is 11, 12 for the Teddy, Curious George, 13, 14 on the mini. 16 on this. I have no idea what this is. And then Elmo. 17. 17 total. Tony Dodge is in at 40. I just pick up my papers that I dropped. Okay. Hi, Lynn. Thank you for coming. Thank you for watching. Tony's at 40. We're going to call it. Anybody else interested? It's Tony Dodge. We're going to go once to Tony. We're going to go twice to Tony. I have to sneeze. <laughs> Ooh, excuse me. And with a fair warning for the plush lot. To Tony Dodge. Batteries should be removed. Yes. Thank you, Toilet Girl. Thank you, PN. We are sold. Sold, sold, sold. Thank you. Thank you, Robin. Tony Dodge for $40. Awesome. Congratulations and great deal. Thank you, Lynn. Thanks, you guys. 90 of you here. Thank you, everyone. Please go over and check the um, thumbs up button. Flush. Tony Dodge. Lot 11. All right, Tony. All right, let me move this out of the way. Be right back. <clears throat> okay, I got a nice Christmas lot. Okay, so the first item in the Christmas slot is this water dome. It's new in the package, and it does say 2010, and it's the type that you put a photo frame in it. You'd be surprised if you're a reseller. This will sell because anybody who had anything that happened in 2010, whether it was like a wedding or a birth or even a death, um, they will look for something like this to put a photo inside of it. And you can't buy this in the store anymore. So you know where they're going to turn to, right? eBay to buy something like this. So I'm going to start this lot off at um, $25 shipped. Okay. The next item is a six, six geese are laying the 12 days of Christmas. It's not... Um, Dated 1989. Oh, it's Hallmark. Oh, I was going to say it's not a brand name, but it is. It's 1989 Hallmark. So this is vintage. Hallmark has a huge following. Just so that you guys know, they do have a huge following. Okay. So that's Hallmark. And, um, this one is another Hallmark. It's a special dog on it. Yeah, my Andrew was born. See, Carla? See, people have connections with them, with stuff like that. And here's another keepsake ornament, 12 Days of Christmas Collector Series. 
And here's another Hallmark keepsake ornament. And another Victorian. Oh, this is a Thomas Kincaid. Hallmark with Thomas Kincaid. That's pretty awesome. Um, this one is Baby's First. Baby's First, Baby Boy's First. Um, and is that a Hallmark? Oh, yeah, it's a Hallmark. Look, see, Hallmark. Unbreakable Satin Ornament, 1983, Baby's First. This one is... 1983 glass ornament love it's a love one these holy smokes the original price on these was 24.75 let's see what they are oh they're hallmark hallmark keepsake silver sleigh Old World Silver Collection Showcase. I didn't know that they had like specialty ones. Is that two of the same? Oh no, they're different. Was it different? Here's a little Christmas plush. Oh. It needs batteries, but the, the tail just scared me because it's singing. You can hear it, but the tail wiggled for a minute, but it looks like it needs batteries. Oh. <laughs> How cute is that? That's very cute. Okay, so you get that in there. And here's some more Hallmark keepsake, Joy of Sharing. That's that's that same the same collection. These boxes I've never seen these boxes. And a special friends. And then there's a bunch of um, clings in that I put in here. These are like I don't know if there's a market for these or if you guys want to just give them as gifts or. But those are in this box, this Christmas dibble box. I put those in there. And this is probably just like a dollar store item, but I, I put it in there anyways because some people, I know I, I sometimes like to put just like a little Christmas tree like that. It's got lights, um, you know, in a little corner of the house. Sometimes those are cute or people that build villages. Um, there's this little plaque that says, bless us all, a little plaque trivet and there's this pack of cards which is unopened and then there's this pack of cards which is um it's opened and it looks like there's an assortment of cards in there there's different ones not just all peanuts um it's hallmark but it looks like somebody opened it up and put just an assortment in there and then there's this little basket and in it, there's this ornament and just an assortment of just little, just little ornaments inside this little basket. Little mouse, little rubber ducky, little snowman, little glass snowman. So that's, he's, he's in there too. And that's the whole dibble box. That's everything in it. All these Hallmark ornaments, the cards, the stuffed animal, and the snow globe. Just a nice mix. And we are at Lisa's Treasures is in at 30. Thank you, Lisa. All Hallmark. Okay, anybody else? Should we close it? Should we close it? To Lisa for $30 for the Christmas Dibble Box. Lot number 12. 
going once to Lisa. Thanks, Mama G. Going twice to Lisa. Ooh, look at you with the fancy hit it, M Mama G. That's cool. And oh, farmer's in the house. Hello, farmer. And with a fair warning, we are sold, sold, sold to Lisa. Lisa's treasures for $30. Good girl. Here, Bo, come and get this, honey. There you go. Thank you, my dear. Okay. Let's see what's in this bag. It's clothing. Let's see what we got. $25 to start. You have a pair of South Pole size 42 men's shorts. Just because we're coming to the end of the summer doesn't mean that they won't sell. People still go on cruises and vacations. And this one is a Nike Golf NBC Beijing 2008 orange um, sports shirt. Looks like from the Olympics. This one is Heritage America. And it's a graphic, Lone Wolf. It's all embroidered. These are all embroidered patches. Everything on here is embroidery. Donna, I would like a Disney lot with Mickey and Minnie in it. Plush lot of Mickey and Minnie, love. I'll write you down. Thank you. Um, oh, wait a minute. This was uh, $30 to Lisa's Treasures. I didn't make that stone. For Christmas. Lot number 13. Um, okay, to love. Um, you want it to be all Mickey and Minnie or with Mickey and Minnie? It might be hard for me to do all Mickey and Minnie, but I'll do my best for the Disney lot. With Mickey and Minnie. Okay, thank you. Yes. Um, you guys, if there's anybody else that wants a Disney lot, they're $75. It's a big lot, and it um, will be a mixture of all Disney. With Mickey, I always make sure there's Mickey and Minnie in there, like Goofy, Donald, Princesses, anybody, any Disney character. I just have a huge assortment. Okay, so that was uh, three items there. That was three. This one is... Um, it's dry cleaned, whatever it was. Um, I'll give you the name on it. And this is the shirt. Um, Original series, that's the name of it. A Tiziano. You can look it up. I don't know. I don't know what this brand is. Um, so there's that one. It looks like most of this stuff is men's. Oh, I lied. Here's a woman's. This one is, oh, we all know this name. Bizu Bizu. It's a sundress. White. It's a little bit dirty in the back. You'll have to wash it. This one is 
new with tags, $69.99. It's H&M. It's a kind of like a bomber style jacket. Hey, Lifetime. Thank you for joining the membership. I appreciate it. Silver member, new in the house. Thank you so much. Um, but this is, it looks like a, like a small women's bomber jacket type of style. $25, you guys, for the whole clothing lot, $25 to start. This is, is this Forever 21? Forever 21. And their jeans, they look like they're in great shape. There's the bottom of them. They're not worn out at all. Next is Diamond Stash. I have no idea. Size medium. They're sweatpants. With zippers on the side. Diamond Stash is the name. I don't know if it's like a inexpensive brand. I've never heard of it. <clears throat> Let's see what else is here. This is Made in Italy Gucci. Made in Italy Gucci, size 10. It's a hoodie. Feels a little bit, feels a little bit sticky. It doesn't smell. doesn't have any odor to it. Probably would want to wash it. Made in Italy Gucci. And this one is West Coast Champs. Oceanside, California, 2017. I don't think this is anything special, but I'll just throw it in. Somebody might be looking for it. You never know. Oh, look what I just found. Burberry. So talk about a mix of stuff in this. And these are kids' Burberries. Obviously, I didn't put this lot together. So these are kids' Burberry, Burberry pants. And they're in excellent condition. That's easy money right there. There's an easy list and easy money on that one. And this one is uh, 1989 Place. It must be the ch children's place. It's in excellent condition. It's a little girl's dress. Just a little girl's dress. And then this last piece is Banana Republic, and it's silk. Oh, wait, there's more in the bag. Let's see what this is. What is this? 100% polyester. No idea. What is this? Oh. Woven heart, one size fits all. Oh, it's kind of like a shawl type of thing. Um... Yeah, it's like a shawl thing. Okay, let me see if there's any bids on it. I wasn't paying attention. Um, let's see. Nikki D's at 31. Nikki D is at 31. I don't have this. Um... Oh, I see. Yes, I will add you as an admin. Thank you so much, Lucinda. I will. Have to remind me, though, after I get off. Jill is out. Nikki D's at 31. Let's close it. Let's close it. Thank you so much. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff going on in there. Anybody else want to come in? We're at 31 for Nikki. Cinnamon, cinnamon vinegar. Can you please make um, a um, comment? And Trisha, can you also please make a comment so I can give you wrenches? Thanks, T. 
Hi, Katie Ann. How are you, honey? Okay, this is a great lot. $31. Is that what we're selling it for? ST would say, what? $31. That's a great deal. Hi, Joyce. All right, we're going to go once. Hi, Trisha. 33 to Susan Arrington. Excuse me. 33 to Susan Arrington. I'm tired, Donna. Are you, Katie Ann? You've been up partying all night? 33 to Susan Arrington. Um, Nikki, what do you think, honey? You want to come in at 35? 40 to Nikki D. Thank you. Thank you, Nikki D. Thank you so much for the clothing lot. There's some good names in there. You should do well. $40 shipped to your house. 42 would be the next bid. Thank you, Mama G. 20 girl is so popular. <laughs> Susan Arrington is out. Nikki D's at 40. We're going to close it going once. Can you wrench my friend Trisha? Trisha, make a comment so I don't have to go looking for you, honey. Going twice to Nikki. Thank you, Lucinda. And with a fair warning to Nikki D. Trisha, there you are. All right, honey, you got it. There was somebody else T said needed a wrench, but if they could make a comment, that would be great. We are sold. Sold, sold, sold. She did Donna and Cinnamon. Okay, she did. Sorry, you guys. I'm doing my best. Okay, Cinnamon. Okay, make a comment. She made a comment. Fresh, fresh girl. Okay. Cinnamon made a comment. And who else needed to make a comment? You guys help me. It takes a village. Okay. We're sold to Nikki D for $40. Thank you, Nikki D. Okay. Anybody? Did anybody say they wanted a Disney lot before I go on? It's a big Disney lot of plush, $75. She got me. I did. I got her. You got them both. Okay, Robin. Thank you. Okay. Keep that in mind. Keep it in mind. Keep it in mind. I also did fill up some more jars. If you guys are interested in my jars, I'm um, going to do this piece of silver. These jars... $40 for the mystery jars, mystery jars of jewelry. You don't get the jar. You just get what's in the jar. It's mystery jars of jewelry for $40. If anybody wants them, let me know and I'll write it down. Okay, so you guys can let me know on that. If there's anybody that wants a mystery jar, you get a lot of necklaces, bracelets, no earrings, just necklaces and bracelets mixed in. Okay. I would love a game lot. Laugh out loud. Hey, Dennis, do. How are you, honey? You can wrench Lifetime. Okay. Thank you so much, Lifetime. And thank you so much for buying a membership. Dennis, I'll send you a game lot. Name your price, honey. Whatever you want. And I will get you a game lot. You name your price and I'll send it to you. It will be a mystery game lot. How's that? Okay, let me do this. This is really beautiful. This is all sterling. It's really dark. It needs to be cleaned. But this chain is sterling. This pendant is sterling. 
and I think that this is rose quartz. I have no idea, but I'm going to start the bidding on this at, I will call you later. Okay, Dennis. Awesome. Thank you so, so much, sweetheart. This is, um, I don't know, rose quartz jewelry people. Okay, let me wipe my lens. Looks like it, right, Carla? And it's a lot of silver. It's heavy. Looks like rose quartz. There's the piece. It's a rose. Look how beautiful it is. Nine two five, and it does have a maker's brand on it. Yeah, it's so pretty, Rachel. And then um, this is what's on the chain. As in addition to the, I don't know what that symbol is. It must be the maker. And then it does say nine two five on the chain. And I'm gonna start it at twenty five. Lifetime comes in at 30. It's actually three chains. Look, one, two, three, but it's super, super dirty. But I'll tell you what, it has a really pretty like patina about it that it's so dirty like that. Some silver looks pretty just left dirty. Um, I could try to weigh it for you, but I think that most of the weight is the rose quartz. I just can show you like, um, so it measures eight and a half inches long. Um, but you can see like on my hand how much silver that is. It's a lot of silver. And um, let me find my scale. It was right here. And it's not here anymore. Why does my scale keep disappearing? I don't take it out of this room. I swear to you, I don't. This time I found it on the floor. Oh, it's on the floor again. Okay. So, um, what I'll do is I'll take the pendant off the chain. and I'll measure the chain, and then I'll measure the pendant. That way you have an idea. So just the chain alone is 15.9 grams, okay? 15.9, just for the chain. And then you have this, which you're, it's 21 grams, but you're really, it's, it's the rose quartz that weighs so much. But this is the chain. Robin, don't leave. Why is Robin leaving? Tammy goes in at 45. What's going to happen, you guys? Bye, Robin. Why is Robin leaving? Something happened? Okay, so lifetime is at 47. Katie's like, Palmer, what did you do? Later, y'all. With the rolling eyes. I don't mind. I don't mind the chitter chatter in, in the chat. I was watching somebody's auction the other day and somebody was making a comment about how they like to go into that auction because there was no drama, <laughs> no chitter chatter. But I wouldn't change our auction for anything, you guys. Jean-Pierre, buonasera. Ciao, bello. Come stai oggi? <laughs> My friend Jean-Pierre's in the chat. 
Okay. Beautiful rose quartz, sterling silver, should we call it? Lifetime's at 47. Right, Carla? Heck no. Let's not change it. 47. Going once to lifetime. Let's make sure Tammy's out. Tammy's out. I love the chatter. Right, Katie? I know. We're going to go twice. As long as there's no fighting. Right, Carla? I agree. And we're going to go twice. Thank you, Mama G. And with a fair warning on the beautiful rose quartz necklace, Lifetime gets it for $47. First time buyer. Thank you, Lifetime. Lifetime, do you want us to call you Lifetime or do you have a name that you want to share with us? It's up to you. Let us know. Congratulations. Hi, Andrea. Hello, Andrea Baker. Okay. Lot number 16. I'm going to do these other earrings. Lifetime email Donna at auctionsbydonna at yahoo.com. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yes. Yep. Farmer, farmer. Okay, let me get this, my next earring tray, and you do get the stand. $25 to start, and you do get the stand, and these are uncurated, put together by my one and only beautiful Cesarina. I have to say, those look like silver, but I'm not saying. I didn't look at them. She put, the, she put this together for me this morning. She wanted to buy a candle. And I said, all right, if you want to buy the candle, you have to work it off. So she <laughs> put together these earrings, earrings for me. Is that the gold one? Huh? No, the gold one is over there. I already sold it. Okay. Uh, can you tell them that there's an earring missing from... Asia? Yes, I have to find it. Yeah. It fell over there. Yeah, that we saw it. 50 to Tammy. This is a beautiful velvet stand. How many pairs, Katie? Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight. Give or take one. My counting's bad. You can ask all our friends here. uncurated you guys i did not promise you promise you look at anything here i just gave her those look like silver too right i just gave her the big bag and i said match these up tammy comes in at 75 You know me, I'm not like other, I'm not like channels that, the only time I look things up is to see if it's worth bringing to auction. Tammy's at 100. Thank you, honey. Several sterling P. Hi, Gianna. Thanks for coming in. Looks like it, right, honey? Looks like it to me. Susan's out. Tammy's at a hundred. Bottom row teardrop almost looks like turquoise. What is it? Quite turquoise? I don't know what that is. Oh, Jana, you're so sweet. Second from bottom row. Second from bottom row. Oh, that one there. I don't know. I don't know, to be honest with you. But we're going to go once to Tammy for 100. 
Tammy wants it. It's a version of turquoise. Really? I could have spent more time on the jewelry shows and learn, or maybe I shouldn't because <laughs> then I'll recognize things and you guys won't get the deals. <laughs> Going twice to Tammy. <laughs> I'm going to call this the silver earring holder. And we are sold. Are you thinking white buffalo turquoise? I don't know. We're sold, sold, sold to Tammy for $100. Thank you, Tammy. Thank you, sweetheart. Here, um, Chezzy. Yeah. Come here, baby. Take this from me. And just put it over there with the other one. Careful, careful. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Um, I have this bag here. I don't know what's in here. Um, let's see. I'm gonna do them. I'm gonna do them together. Um, there's this piece here. It's. I'm just going to start this at $10 and see where it goes. I'm thinking that this is all like natural stones. It's all, it's cold. Um, but look at the, look at the clasp on this one. Look at, it's like a stone. $10 to start on these. And then look at the way it, see the way it, I mean, I would almost wear that in front, right? The way it closes. Like I wouldn't even want to put that in the back. Beggar's beads. Is that what they are? Beggar's beads? Look how pretty. So these are all definitely stones. Because they're all cold. $10 to start. Who's interested? $10 to start on those and... I have this too. This here's got a sterling silver clasp on it. I think this is just glass beads, but I'll include that too in it. And this has a sterling silver clasp also. I'll include that in it too. And I don't know if this has a sterling silver clasp. I have no idea. It's in the bag with sterling silver, but I didn't look. I mean, I can tell just by like sometimes just looking um, at the clasp. Like I'll show you. Like this one here, like definitely is, I think, sterling. See how it's tarnished and then it's got like that shape. So I'm gonna say that's I'm gonna say that's sterling too. So, so this is what you get. I don't know if I have one of those um, necklace things to put this on to show you nicely, but I, I don't have it right here. So this is what you get. You get all of these like pretty colored stones. That's in my hand. Twenty. Woo's Tom Cruise. What is that? Is that your new name? <laughs> Sun Moon Cricket is out. Thank you for bidding. I didn't see that you were bidding. Thank you, sweetheart. Oh, there you are. Yep, I see you bidding. And where are we at? Twenty for Tom Cruise. Thanks, Tom. Tom is broadening his horizon. Buying jewelry. Look at all these pretty beads. Should we call it? To Mr. Cruz? Anybody else want to come in? Going once to Tom. Nice collection. Thanks, Mary. 
going twice the charm. Yes, right, Cinnamon? Are you the real Tom Cruise? I don't know. Okay, going three times to Mr. Tom Cruise. And we are sold, 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 sold to Tom. Great deal, Tom. He comes in right at the perfect time, $20. Lot number 17 to Tom for $20 for the bracelets. Awesome, Tom. Good job, sweetheart. Six o'clock. Okay, we still have time. All right, let me go get another lot. Be right back. Okay. All right. Who wants to buy a bucket of keychains? 25 to start. I'll show you some of them. They are lanyards and keychains. I have not gone through them, so I don't know what's here. Um, I'll give you an example. Like this is Aries. And this one is a Land Rover. And this one says Abigail, Ocean City, Maryland. And what's this one say? Take a little chance, Florida Lotto. Just a little Lucite one. Um, let's see. There's a lot in here. I don't know. I don't know who this is. Aloha Hawaii. Maria Mala. Electrolux. Isn't that the vacuum cleaner? This is one of those purse holders. It's brand new. Here is um, just a little keychain. This one says 2020. So you, you don't know what you're going to find in here. Here's Honda. Just, just to give you an idea, I'm not going to go through and show each and every one. Here's a ball, um, whatever that's called. A um, um, Here's a flag with a wooden... I don't know who that is. I'll show you the whole thing. There's a lot. There's a lot in here. Um, keychains do sell well. I bought keychains for my kids last year for Christmas, actually. They all said Denali on them. Um, I guess this is, did I show this Honda one? Oh, this is really cute. This is a little book, a little wildlife book. Here's a guitar. Um, 
Is there any interest for the keychain lot? It's a treasure hunt. Great for anybody who does um, like video content too to do an unboxing. All emojis. No? You guys saw it pass? I'll bring them back another night. Federal Express. <clears throat> It's a real pretty one. I don't know. I mean, if I didn't know better, it looked like it was. I was looking at it to see if I saw 925 on that. If I didn't know better, it kind of looked like silver to me. They're all keychains and lanyards. All keychains and um, lanyards are in here. I'll show you. Oops, let me put these back. Oops, I almost put this beautiful necklace in there. Yeah, keychains and lanyards, just right past. If you're not interested, nobody wants them for $25. That's what's in here. Keychains and lanyards, lifetime. Sorry, I've been on the phone. Are they all keychains? Um, yeah, keychains and lanyards. Oh, where's this one? Oh, this is the sack. This is that. Um, so there's just a mix. Not your type of lanyards, Gary. Gary, did you get did you get the strap? <laughs> did it arrive yet? <laughs> did it come, Gary? Did it? Are you using it? What are you doing with it? He's not answering. Farmer, he's not answering us. I know he must have got it by now. <laughs> People are laughing, but he's not answering. What did I do with my pen? My pen. It was just here. Okay, I'm going to pass on this, you guys. Not yet. It will make a cool video. You had to have got it, Gary. I sent that last week. How is that possible that you didn't get it yet? I don't believe it. Go check your mailbox. When was the last time you checked your mailbox? You had to have got it. Just sent a picture. You didn't send a picture. What is he talking about? Just sent your a picture. I didn't get a picture. God, Gary. It's probably at the P.O. box. It has to be. And it's probably been there for, for days. I'm kidding, Donna. <laughs> that would have been so funny. If you did send a picture, I would have showed everybody. With you wearing it on top of your head, of course. <laughs> right? On top of your head. <laughs> Donna, did you send my purses yet? Which ones? Are you asking about the Vera Bradley ones? Because I sent those out a long time ago. Those are the last purses I bought from you, I think. That you bought from me, I think. I did. <laughs> this one. We'll have to check the tracking on that music. I hope hey. they're not lost. Sorry. What are you yelling about? Okay. Next lot. Plush. This one is washing instructions, spot clean only. 
I have no idea, but it's a cat. I know I should have put this aside because I have a I have somebody who wants a cat lot, but it's um it's a squishy it's a squishy cat. Oh, <laughs> Donna. <laughs> yes, yes. I don't know. I don't know what he's going to do with it. Farmer wanted him to have it. This one, the tag has been cut off of it. Um, but it's a monkey and monkeys have great following. So you could probably find this. If you look under monkeys, you'll find it. This one, let's see. Oh, it's one of those. It's an interactive one with the USB. I guess you put on your phone and usually they light up and say something. This one is Buddy. <laughs> I guess it has a zipper in the butt. I'm not kidding. Look. Look what this is. That's what it's called. Is this a joke? Zip it and flip it and love it. Zip it and flip it. Oh, it 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 turns into God. it turns it turns into a ball. <laughs> it turns it turns into a ball, Mama G. Body balls. <laughs> it turns into a ball. <laughs> oh, nothing is safe at this channel. Honest to goodness. I mean, I just, <laughs> right, Susan? Sorry. Ooh, bolo busted. <laughs> oh, God. So, I mean, come on. Body balls and then. <laughs> Look where the zipper is. Are you kidding, Courtney? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Courtney. I'm trying to be so good. But this is not right. <laughs> Who designed this? Who designed this? This is like dangly. <laughs> I want to know who designed this. Because they should be fired. <laughs> All right, enough about dangly balls. <laughs> Sorry, Courtney. <laughs> Sorry, Courtney. I'm trying to be, I know, I'm trying to be good. I'm keeping it professional. <laughs> no, I'm not, Bomber. All I said, all I did was read the tag. All I did was read the tag and look at the dangly thing. <laughs> That's all I did. Dandy. Is this another cat? I need to put the cats away for an order. I don't know why all these cats ended up in this thing. Okay, here's the unicorn. Let's see if it needs to turn on. Usually they work. It needs batteries. But this is one of those unicorns that shine the, the stars up on the ceiling in a child's dark room. Here's a wild republic. And it's a turtle. It's a pretty turtle. Wild republic turtle. Oh, gosh. This one works. This is one of those interactive. Needs batteries. It has all of these areas that you squeeze but it needs batteries hi massimo Hello. massimo and and my husband are home from um um costco <laughs> their daily that? costco run oh. um smurfs so um just to just to top it all off um our refrigerator in the garage broke yesterday so we had to throw everything out in the freezer because it defrosted. Um, there wasn't that much really in there, but enough. 
and um, we had to go out and buy a new refrigerator yesterday. It's a scratch and dent. It's still really, really nice. I love it. And so my husband couldn't wait to go fill it back up. So he went to Costco. <laughs> There's this little, is that one of the anime dolls? I don't know. You guys. And then I don't know who he is either. Um, is he like from one of the cartoon things? I don't know. You guys will have to. I know this one's Veggie Tales. I know that's one of the Veggie Tales. And this one is, oh, it's Limited 2. I think this company's gone out of business, right? Limited 2 has gone out of business. They're no longer in business. And this one is called Ideal Toys Direct, but it's a llama with teeth showing, which is really cute. And llamas are hot right now with the kids. Don't know why. Things trend. Just you this one's Barbie. What? This is a little Barbie dog. It has a little Barbie tag on it. Sonic, maybe the black one. Maybe. I don't know. This one, oh, this is one of those bear factory bears. Um, but it's not a bear. It's a cute little puppy dog. Where did you find this log, Donna? Uh, in my, oh, and here's a moose tissue box holder. That's a moose tissue box holder. Okay, so that's one, two. The llama is three. The llama is cute, you have to admit. Three. Barbie is four. Limited two is five. Veggie Tales, six. Don't know who, seven. Don't know who again, eight. Smurf at nine. Fisher Price Interactive Toy, 10, Wild Republic Turtle, 11, Unicorn Stars, 12, Cat Dandy, 13, The Balls Bear, 14, the my the leapfrog oh this is leapfrog it's not fisher price it's leapfrog is it 13 or 14 we'll say 14 make sure 14 the monkey is 15 and the other cat the soft one is 16. 16 pieces of flesh. And who's interested? I saw Joy come in at 25. Andrea comes in at 27. Thank you, Andrea. This is plush. Joy at 29. What do you think, Andrea? 31? Thirty-two. Thirty-four. Thanks, ladies. Thank you so much. Thirty-four. We're gonna call it. Andrea, let us know, honey. Thirty-six would be your next to bed. Andrea's out. $34 to Joy. Thank you, Andrea. Thank you, Joy, so much. Congratulations. Joy gets it for $34. Lot number 18, plush. All right. Thanks, guys. All right. I'll be right back.
stop the auction? Yeah. You don't stop the auction? Yeah. I was going to stop making dinner. Yeah, you can. You can. You can start. It doesn't matter. It's fine. They're used to the noise in the background. Okay. So I have a small lot here. Um, I think most of them are TY. And I have an order for someone. I think it's Love that wants TY all with tags. I'm going to be able to fill that order. So, um, oh, so this is the dark TY tag. So I don't know. Um, I don't know enough about TY. I don't know if you guys know. This one is, leave it to me. His name is Clay. Um, but these have the tags on them. This is the special TY tag. See how it's bigger than other TY tags? I'm trying to see if I can see a difference. All right, so 25 to start on the TY lot. I'll show you what I've got. Hold on. Yeah, see, this is, there's a difference in them. See how the, it's Thai, it's not TY, it's called Thai. The man that designed these is Thai. And see how this has that kind of tag. And this one has this kind of tag. You're going to have to do some research. I'm not sure. 25 to start. You've got the kitten, which is adorable. You've got this looks like a some sort of bear. You've got the, um, what is this, a snowman. You have the happy birthday bear. This one is not TY, but it was in the mix. This one is pink, but pink has a following too. That's a pink. This one is a gund. So these are these are good for people that don't have a lot of space that want to be resellers. Um, here's a raspberry colored bear. This one looks like a Canadian, a Canadian bear. White Canadian. Um, these some of these have um, the protectors on them. Here's another bear. Oh, this one's adorable. This one is like a psychedelic multicolored, some sort of dog. And this one's really cute too, 10th anniversary with the little bow tie. And this one is adorable too. The tag on it. We have a gorilla, and this this even has a different type of tag. See, tie. This is a a gorilla. Also, it has a heart on the paw. Just gonna have to research them. I don't know enough about this stuff. This one's really cute. It's a unicorn. This one's a unicorn one tie as well and oh my gosh this one's adorable oh and it's got the dark tag on it see some of them have the dark tag look at this it's it's a rat i'm not even gonna call it a mouse it looks like a rat oh and that's a cute uh baboon a baboon this one is a gallery. It's just a little, little girl. And TY again. TY. Panda bear. They all have tags on them. Every single one of them has a tag on it. And here's a little monkey, little McDonald's monkey one. So there's a total of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 
8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, that's it, 23. 23 of them. Jonathan Roseberry, thank you so much for the super chat. You're a sweetheart. Thank you, honey. Thank you, thank you. Okay. And we have Tony's out. Love is in at 39. Gary said, I'll be right back. Anyone know Donna? She keeps sending me stuff. What do I keep sending you, Wes? You need to buy more, Wes, so I can send you stuff. Going once to love for $39. How many pieces was it, you guys? 20? Did I say it was 20 pieces? I don't remember. Or was it more? Going twice to love. Twenty-two. Oh, thank you. Twenty-two pieces. Twenty-two pieces. Um, twenty-three pieces. All right, we'll say twenty-two to twenty-three pieces. Okay. And with a fair warning, to love for thirty-nine dollars for. 22 to 23 pieces of beanies were sold. Okay, who else wants a lot for TY? Who else wants a, a lot of um, 23 to 20, 22 to 23 pieces for $39? Who else? Anybody else? Anybody else? Let me know, and I'll fill orders. It's going to be mystery. Similar to this, but you just don't know what you're going to get. Anybody else? Okay. All right. We're going to do another plush giveaway. We're going to do another dog plush giveaway. Mama G, when you put the hearts in, the first person to write, my dog is number one, gets a dog lot of toys. My dog is number one. After Mama G puts the hearts in. Make sure you're on live chat. There's the hearts. My dog is number one. My dog is number one. Sexton Cole wins the dog lot. $25 dog lot. Congratulations. Congratulations. Awesome. My dog is number one. Okay. Okay. All right, you guys. So I think that I'm going to, um, if anybody wants to give me orders for anything that you know I have standards of, I've got the makeup jars. I've got the, congratulations, Saxton. I have um, the makeup jars. I can do um, uh, Thai orders, uh, TY. I can do TY orders. Um, I can do Disney orders. I can do mixed plush lot orders. Um, I think that's all I can do right now. You guys let me know. And you can email me also. Um, you can send me an email if you don't want to do it. How weird. I cannot see Saxton and I thought I was invisible. Donna, my lot is 23 TYs. 23. Okay. Yep. I have you down. 23 pieces. 23 pieces. 
I wish I was a reseller so I could buy something. Connie, I have records coming for you next week, honey. Save your money. I have lots of records. Makeup jars, jewelry jars. Yes, I've got the jewelry jars right there. Those are $40. Um, I don't have puppets. I don't have enough to do puppets. Definitely not. Um, hey, Mary. Hi, honey. Why can't we see Saxton? I can see him. You can't see him, Tammy? I see Saxton. Yeah, I wish I could do all puppets for you, Shelly, but I could write it down and, like, keep puppets aside for you. And when I get a lot big enough, um, I will... That's so strange that no one can see Saxton. I see him. Oh, okay. Okay, you guys. Um, okay, so if anybody has um, any final special request, there's still 71 of you here. Thank you so much. I will take a, a, a box of gold bars. Farmer, you have a mystery box coming to you. Um, 626, you guys go get something to eat. Take a little break. I thought I was going crazy. You're not chat me. Tea comes on at 7 with Rachel. And have fun. I'll be in the chat watching. I'm probably going to come back on again tomorrow. I'm going to build some more lots. I didn't have a lot of lots built this time, this auction. I kind of threw a bunch of stuff together. I had a busy, busy morning. Um, I wish I had more for you. What? But I didn't. I'm going to go have some nice dinner now and relax for about 20 minutes before tea comes on. I appreciate you, Mama G, for helping. And Robin, if you're still in the background, I don't know why you left, but I appreciate you helping to mod earlier. Um, hello, Dolores. Um, thank you, Joy, of course. Have a great evening. Yeah, I'm going to relax, Carla, you know, and, and watch um, cause problems in the chat with Rachel <laughs> and T. Um, so thanks. Thank you, guys. You guys are awesome. All right. We'll see everyone in a half an hour over at T's channel um, for another auction. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Might be going out in the morning with the girls, and then I'll come on in the afternoon and do a a quick manja. Yep, exactly, Tony. I'm so hungry. So off to mod. Oh my gosh, Mama G. I don't know how you do it. You are always so busy. All right. Bye for now. Thank you for the super chats. You guys are great. Um, come on over. There's T. Come on over at seven o'clock. There's her, her um, channel. And have fun over there, and I'll see you guys in the chat over there, okay? So...